What up, YouTube audience? It is SimCurt16 here, and welcome to another Pop Funko review. This time we're doing two, one normal size, and one six inch size again. And this time we're gonna do from the new movie that's coming out pretty soon, and I'm pretty excited to see it, and I think it's the appropriate time to do it. I have many more pops of the same category, same movie, but I can't fit them all in one video, so I'm gonna be doing two of them. And probably two videos of it, I don't know, I, I don't know what I'm gonna do, but either way. The two pops I'm gonna do the reviews are from the new movie Marvel's um, Avengers Affinity War. And I can't wait to see that movie. Every superhero they come out from, from the years since I was a kid, from the first Iron Man movie that came out, to Thor, to Hulk, to Captain America, every single hero. And the first hero I'm planning on doing the review on right now is from the Marvel category and again from the Infinity War movie and he is first Iron Man number 285 and the collection comes with Iron Man, Thor, Iron Spider, Captain America, Thanos and a couple of villains of henchmen I don't really care about Root and Hulkbuster Pretty much I want the whole set except for the minions. I don't really care about the minions. All I know, pretty much can tell you this is I'm missing at least three of them. And if leave a comment up, no, I say, I'll just tell you who I'm missing. I'm pretty much missing Captain America, Thor, and Thanos. But the Thanos pop, the thing is, I don't know what I want from him. Like, there's three different federations, now four different federations of Thanos. One is the normal, where he's normal size, like the regular size pops. With his Infinity Glove, there's Thanos activating one of them. Then there's the 6 inch and 10 inch Thanos, which I want the 10 inch Thanos pop. And uh, right now, uh, Hot Topic News, they have released Thanos sitting on his throne. So that one I'm gonna go after, I'm gonna go to the mall. And see if I can pick my pick one up. But if they don't, because I heard they were hitting stores, and hopefully they hit my store where I can go and purchase. But if I can, I can. But on that, let's go on to the second pop. I'm gonna be doing the review is the Hulkbuster number two ninety four. Okay, now let's do the um. Hulkbuster first since he's the gonna be he this one is the biggest one that that if I'm ever gonna do a review on sex and pops. Okay, got him out. Uh, oh yeah, and this is kinda of funny, this little bobblehead. Pretty much yeah, every Marvel pop it's gonna be a bobblehead no matter what. And DC pops, I don't know if they are. I don't know if I have any DC pops up right now. I do probably just the Joker, but he's an 8 bit pop. I have to look back at my collection because I do have Batman Beyond. I do have Batman the anime an animation series. Oh, yeah, they're not bobblehead. DC bo um, pops are not bobblehead, only Marvel's. So as you can see immediately this um pop is definitely a bobblehead. Funny though, but I see nothing wrong with this. It's all perfect. The head it looks like how it looks like in the trailer. The arms are good, the back is good, the little chest plate here is good, everything from the color to the designs to the details and pretty much yeah, there's no need. Um, the thing I don't know, it looks good enough to stand up by itself, but the thing is, I don't know if that's true. I don't know if I will have to do something to have it st um, stand up perfectly, because, like I said in my couple videos on my sex ends, pops that some of them don't stand up quite well, and I have to do something to make sure they stand up straight and not tip over and, and, pray and pretty much break on me. But uh, yeah, here is the um, Hulkbuster pop, and the the test I will pretty much do once I get out Iron Man out, because this Iron Man is different from the other one. 
here it is all the angles doing this now because it's gonna be a long video if I don't okay I'm gonna put him on his back now for the, the little Iron Man I'm pretty excited for the movie to come out I can't wait how it all plays out okay Uh, they got him on here quick. Very good. See, I can't get him out of the package yet because of this little string connected to it. So, for me to get him out, I have to get a pair of scissors here. I think I had him laying around. Okay. There we go. Here's Iron Man. He comes with a little stand since he's flying. Because since you know he's flying, since those little boosts on his on his um feet, and he's ready to blast somebody. And yeah, and you can tell he got wings this time in this seal for some reason, even though he never needed to. I don't know what's the point of it, but it it will tell it will show us in the movie maybe. So here is Iron Man. In battle mode, I guess I can call it. I don't know. It is called Iron Man on the box. It doesn't say what type of Iron Man or what suit of Iron Man this is. But either way, it's still a good Iron Man to get. And one, and I like how they have a stand look like he is flying and he is off the ground. So most definitely he will be standing up perfectly well. So I can do a three stick suit spin on my hand right here so you can see how it looks like. And I got perfect sunlight. Do so. Yeah, okay, there's Iron Man. And from here, he they got every detail nice and good done. From his blaster to his helmet, um, his wings, the details on the wings, his armor, all that. So pretty much, yeah. So let me see. Well, the only thing, I guess, like, the only test I would have to do is for Hulkbuster to see if he stands up right. Yeah, because as you can see, because as you can see, Iron Man is well standing up without any support or anything that can tip him over. And I do apologize, it is raining outside it. Okay, there's Iron Man, and now time for the Hulkbuster. Let's see if it stands right now. And he does. That goes. That is a nice view right there. Iron Man with Hulkbuster. Okay, that's it for now. Thank you again, everybody, for watching this Pop Funk review. I gave you two pops in the price of one video. Um. Anyways. I'm like I said. I'm excited for the movie to come out. I and it's coming out this month, and I had and I decided to get them to do the Papa Funk reviews right now before anything else. I know I got at least a couple more pops I need to get. And like I said, I need to get Thanos, Captain America, and Thor. But the Iron Man Groot, I would do a Pop Funk review on them on one video, and hopefully I can get my hands on Thanos and his uh, and Thanos sitting on his throne. But if I can't, I can't, like I said, for Thanos. If I can't get a regular Thanos and exclusive, then I will have no choice but get a normal Thanos. Like, the normal still looks good, but I prefer the 10 inch or an exclusive of Thanos. The Walmart exclusive, not that much. Just the ones I want. Anyways. Anyway, that's it for now. Thank you again, everybody, for watching. This has been Simcrit16. Pop Hunt here. I do have a gaming channel. I'm sorry using my TV to turn on for stuff like this, but I barely woke up and I had to get this stuff done before I go to work. I start work pretty early today, but that's besides the point. Usually, by the time you see this video, it's going to be like later on today. I'm recording this on a Monday, but you probably get this on a Tuesday. When, no, not Tuesday. I have a video ready for that. Um... Uh, let's see, it probably come out either Friday or more. I have no idea, but it's gonna be before the movie comes out. I guarantee you that. But other than that, this is Simcrit16 Pop on here. Everything you know about me, my social media are down in the description box below. 
Also, like I said, I have a main channel where nothing but gameplay videos, unboxing videos, unless if they're Puffung related, they're in this channel. Um, hanging out with my friends and many more stuff on my main channel. So check it out, subscribe, and hit the little bell to notify you when a video has been uploaded onto my main channel. Also, if you're new to my channel, if you're new to my channel, please hit the subscribe, the subscribe button and the notification bell to notify you, like I said, to, when a video has been uploaded and you will not miss a video ever again. But on that, thank you a bit for watching. Um, next month, Fanime. I can't wait and I'm trying to get my cosplay costume ready. And, uh, God damn, it's raining hard. Okay, try to ignore the <laughs> rain, but uh, yeah, Fanime is coming, and I in that video and my Fanime experience again will go on my main channel. I can't do nothing about the rain, so Fanime main channel, Pop Funkos onto that channel. But on that, anything else you want to know about me, my social medias are down in the description box below. Other than that, thank you everybody for watching. This has been SimCurse16, and I'll see you guys all in my next Pop Funko review. See ya!